Good evening. This is Cheryl. Sherry, I mean, uh, this is Sherry Jennings. Got my own name for a second. And um, what I'm doing tonight is a tutorial about how to find information online. Because over the past three years, I have uh, received some of the absolute most absurd and ridiculous questions, which uh, the uh, questionnaire, questioner, questioner could have easily found on Google or Bing. Either one. Either go the, you got, oh, this isn't, this, however, in this case, it's not Google or Bing. Uh, to tell you the truth, I don't know what it is. It's Safari, so I don't, I guess there's a Safari to have its own search engine. Now that's an interesting question. I had never thought of it. I guess Safari is not only a web browser, but a search engine. And that's a legitimate question. I'm not asking anyone about it because I can look that up on uh, Google, Bing, or Safari it, to find out if Safari is a, is a um, search engine and a browser or just a browser with another search engine in it. And so this isn't really what I'm interested in. Well, I'm interested in analytics. That's the truth. Can't lie about that. I uh, This is just a common, well, it's not common, it's an uncommon analytics. It's a, in the field of data science and analytics, this would be an outlier as far as high quality goes. <clears throat> But that's not my real reason for being on, on tonight. Because the majority of my time that I spend is either doing, well, actually doing things like this. I'm, I, I can't lie. I do things like this quite a bit. But what the reason that I got on the, the, the vlog or the monovlog tonight is to do what a lot of times I like to do, and that's look at pictures of pretty girls with all of their clothes on and this is one of my favorite ones to look at and to listen to her music because she sings so this is the anatomy of a I thought it was going to be the anatomy of a Google search but it's not Google and so I'm a little thrown off so that kind of puts me out of my comfort zone a little bit but I feel more in my comfort zone because I was able to find the the search E which is Stevie Nicks who is a singer and I'm gonna she's an American singer songwriter and then uh, I'm gonna go and look here down here and you got your top stories your billboard you got your you got your vulture stories and you got your songs that we all know she's sung you got the the edge of 17 the stop dragging my heart around in the chain and that's from Fleetwood Mac of course then you've got the quotes lots of quotes she is a prolific writer and you can quote her in fact i actually single-handedly uh got her onto a poetry database and found out that her poems according to a, a, a relational database using a very good well if it's a relational database it's not you know maybe that's part of the problem with an algorithm a, re, a relational database draws relations based on actual relations not an algorithm that someone wrote so that's one to think about for me later you got your Facebook you got your Twitter and you got your YouTube and you got your profiles on there there were and then you got people also searched for Cheryl Crow who is trending right she's trending well that's a whole another search in and of itself and the Lindsay Buckingham of course and the Christine McVie and the McFleetwood and the John McVie and the Tom Petty and but she's trending, so now I'm tempted to open up another window, but I better wait for a second because, oh, see web results. This is the anatomy of a web result. I thought I was looking at the web results. So here we go back to the Stevie King. No, Stevie Nicks. I don't know how the hell, why did I say that? I don't know why I said that. Stevie King. Maybe, I don't know why I said that. that was really strange. That was a, a, a truly a bit uh, miss miss. I misspoke. You got your edge of seventeen. You stopped dragging my heart around. A chain by Fleetwood Mac and the 
YouTube, the Stand Back, the, uh, the Belladonna, and the people also searched for trending. And then people also asked, is Stevie Nicks an American? And then instead of pushing down on that little arrow, I think I remember something about that here up at the beginning that where it says that Stevie Nicks is an American singer songwriter. So that question was asked um, within the framework of my search. Down, down. And who is playing with Stevie Nicks? Well, I can answer that one for the bonus daily double, which doesn't involve a prize. It's uh, it's um, Chrissy Hind. Chrissy Hind. And then you got your. Th these questions were actually asked of me in a hospital setting one time by the doctor. Who incidentally called me Stevie Nicks for three days when I, after I checked in. So these questions may come up in, in a hospital stay. The, he wanted to know, uh, when did when did Christine McVie and Stevie Nicks join Fleetwood Mac? And I just about, <clears throat> I just about lost it on that question because it was such a dumb question. Um, well, anyway, so if you, if you're, if you find yourself in a hospital setting and a doctor is asking you about Stevie Nicks, then here's a little bit of information you could give to the doctor. Let's see why she's trending, because she's trending. The Cheryl, the Cheryl Crow and the Lindsay Buckingham and uh, people also searched for Lindsay Buckingham and Christine McVie and McFleetwood, of course. And Jimmy, and Jimmy Iovine. Okay, that I have to laugh because it's a funny inside joke. Okay, and then you got your Cheryl Crow, and then I want to know why she's trending. So I just see Wikipedia. Oh, look at that. she's not five five after all. It's five three. It's written right there. Okay, and then you got your, if it makes you happy, and the soak up the sun, and the first cut is the deepest, and her quotes. I don't know any of her quotes, so I'm going to actually read a couple of them, because, well, this is strange. Okay, well, it's not, I mean, it's strange in a way to me, due to my situation here in the war-torn, I'm not sure if I'm in center town or Greenwood, or an unorganized territory. I can't tell by looking at the map. <clears throat> anyway, the quotes, because I don't, oh wait, I actually, I quote, I quote Cheryl Crow all the time, but I quote her from her songs. So, these are quotes that are on the internet without quote marks, but they're still there. It's not have, having what you want, it's wanting what you've got. I guess they're quoting a song as well. And then it, people don't realize that I'm really funny and I'm an excellent bridge player. Now, I'm going to have to counter counter Cheryl Crow's quote right here. Because I did realize that she is extremely funny. In fact, she's so freaking funny sometimes. I piss myself laughing at some of the stuff she says. But I did not know she was an excellent bridge player. But I'm just going to stop right, right there at the bridge player part. Uh. And leave that there. Suzanne. Cheryl Suzanne Crow. She's not from Los Alamos. But she's a damn good bridge player, according to her. According to Cheryl Crow. I haven't heard her talk about the bridge, you know, a lot. Bridging. Br I have not heard Cheryl Crow talk about being a good bridge player. But apparently she is a good bridge player. And there she is. Look, she's so pretty. And that's one of the things that I like to do. A lot of people don't real look at that. It's like that's almost something I would do. In fact, I think I may have been the one to flip those <laughs> pictures. I'm not sure why they're there, but you have this one looking this way and this one looking this way. Because I can't tell which way they're looking. Dude, I have this uh uh condition called dyslexia and as much as it sucks it doesn't suck because like it'll throw me off like it'll throw me into like a, a spin you know if I see an image that's oriented wrongly from my perspective 
But to see these two pictures together like this, which I find a little bit different because I've never seen anyone online do this before until tonight, this very moment where history is being made with the infamous Cheryl Su Suzanne Crow bridge player extraordinaire. Looking here to the right and looking to the left. And then back to, voila, I don't know, and then, it, wait, oh, I did, I guess I did a new search, no, there's, people also search for Jimmy Iovine, and Joe Walsh, and Christy Hyde, oh, wow, I don't know how, I, this must be like, yeah, that's with Stevie Nicks, because, like, if this, is in, if it were in a relational database like uh, Poem Hunter, which I entered one of Stevie Nicks songs into, and got that re that actual relation and not um, not an algorithm where you have to use filters to get a person's face through the algorithm. So the Suzanne, or so her name is Cheryl Suzanne Crow. She is American and she is a bridge player and. A musician, a singer, songwriter, and an actress. I actually knew she was an actress because she's a freaking good actress. I remember because when I was younger in the 90s, then uh, she was also doing some acting. And it was like, honestly, like if you watch some of her movies, she could have been an actress or just completely just an actress. Or she could have been a bridge player and a songwriter, singer, songwriter, musician. And um, blue-eyed soul singer i think uh i don't like to look at things about people's children there's some things on here about her children so i'm going to stop this video